Good evening, everyone. Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com with uh, 2018 Tops Triple Threads Baseball. Pick your team number nine from a fresh master case. Big thanks to all of these folks for getting to the action. Angels picked up straight up. Greg winning the Yankees in a spot random. That's why he has a little mark next to his name. And big thanks to everyone for getting into the action here. I don't know who had last spot mojo on this. I think it was. This is kind of important. You can't short someone a, a last spot mojo. I think it was Brewers and Marlins. So Jeremy actually gets a double last spot mojo for getting those two teams at once at the very end. So there you go. Got to keep track of that. Very important. Let's pop open this case. And we'll roll the die. One, two, three for the top box. Right here. One, two, three for the top box. Four, five, six for the bottom box. And it's going to be six. We're going to do the bottom box. So this will be for break nine. And this will be for break ten, which is already in the store right now. Jaspiescasebreaks.com. With plenty of teams still available. So go and check it out. So that'll be for next time. And good luck to all in break number nine. Pick a team nine. And once 10 sells out or gets close to selling, I think Nick Jaspi will kind of see that and eventually post another pick your team case. So keep an eye out on jazbeescasebreaks.com. There's three right here, three right there, and three right here to make nine. All right. Good luck, everyone. Fresh case. This Triple Threads has been really fantastic. Stuff seems like it, they, they really loaded up the hits in these. All right, box number one, pick your team nine. Good luck, everybody. All right, so these serial numbered cards will have the shipping team top load or a sleeve and top load before they go out. It's Gary Sanchez, Ozzy Smith. All the base cards will ship too, of course. All right, and your hits behind Andrew Benintendi is Jacob deGrom, 27 out of 36 for Josh Proust and the Mets. Oh, yeah, they've got Benintendi on both sides right here. And then we've got a one of one, Fernando Romero. Wow. That is for Ryan Redman and the Twins. Getting the, the Red Ruby one of one. Nice. All aboard the Big Hit Express. Whoop, whoop. And behind Ben and Tendi is Chance Cisco, Triple Relic, and Autograph, 7 out of 35. For Nicholas and the O's.
And then behind Andrew Benintendi is Justin Upton. Three out of three. A little piece of Justin Upton's lumber going to Aaron Kreger, who got the Angels straight up. Very nice. Three out of three. All aboard. Woo woo. So nice start for Aaron. Nice start for us. Train whistles here. Could be a hot case. Maybe a little something for everybody. I hope. Next one. Justin Verlander, 259, and Ben Intendi to 299. Chris Davis to 99. Dustin Bajor to 259. And then your base cards. Behind Zach Granke is a triple relic. All Rangers. Pudge, Yvonne Rodriguez, Juan Gon Gonzalez, and Adrian Beltre. That is one out of nine. Very nice for the Texas Rangers. That is DVD with the Rangers. There you go, Dustin. I like that. It's cool. <coughs> Excuse me. Got all choked up about that hit. Matt Olson, Jersey and Auto, 7 out of 75 for the A's. Phillip with the Athletics. What a season for the A's. And there's the Bay. Babe Ruth revealing a Reese Hoskins triple relic and autograph. 24 out of 99. Who's got the Phillies in this one? T.J. Poyer with the Phillies. The fighting Phils. And behind Baby Ruth is Matt Carpenter. Piece of his jersey. 15 out of 27. Game used memorabilia. Maybe, maybe some salsa stain on there too. Cardinals. Eric Bailey with the Redbirds. All right, out of 199, J.D. Martinez. And then Anthony Rizzo to 259. On this side, Ichiro to 199. Byron Buxton to 259. Your base cards. Behind Lou Gehrig is a 7 out of 9, Jacob deGrom. Nice ERA triple relic and autograph for the Metropolitans. Josh Proust with the Mets. Your NL Cy Young winner. Behind Lou Gehrig is Trey Mancini. 7 out of 27 relic for Nicholas Secord. Behind Giancarlo Stanton is legend Rhino, Ryan Sandberg, 19 out of 27. Goes to Jason Reardon and his Cubs. And then behind Giancarlo Stanton is Willie Adams. 
15 out of 50. This might be our first raise autograph that we've seen, I think. That goes to David Duffy. Now, maybe we've seen some other guys, but not very not very many. Oh, that's, why the, that's why the rays are priced the way they are. There you go. First third of the break done. I'll work on the second third. <laughs> Joey's like, yeah, of course the Rays hit now. Rex saying, every case I've seen seems to be full of Cubs, Cardinals. Yeah, you know, it does seem like from, and this is not just this year, I feel like, I feel like in just years, in recent years, it seems like triple threads always seems to be a little, uh, always seems to be a little Cubs, Cardinals, and Mets heavy. All right, we've got Ichiro, Kershaw, wait. Pedroia, Ichiro, and your base cards. Bogarts, Frank Thomas. Again, we'll sleeve and top load all of those before they get shipped out, of course. Speaking of shipping, folks, remember, um, Veterans Day is observed on Monday, so post office won't be picking up or anything like that. So just, just know this. Some of your shipments may be like a day later than what you would normally expect. Well, I think most of you won't even notice the difference. Nicholas Secord with the Astros. 12 out of 18 legend. Triple Relic. Nolan Ryan, the Ryan Express. And behind Freddie Freeman is Christian Yelich. Jersey and auto. 2 out of 25 for the Brew Crew. Jeremy S. Last spot mojo. Behind Stroman is Hunter Renfro. Wow. One of one. Wood finish, triple relic, and on wood autograph for the Friars. Aaron Kreger with the Padres. Woo. That is a beaut. Nice. Aaron Kreger all aboard the Big Hit Express. Woo woo! That's crazy. All right. <laughs> Sorry, TJ. Yeah. Uh, Marcus Stroman, Chris Sale, two out of 18. Yeah, the wood one of ones are pretty strong. All right. Next box. Ladies and gentlemen, we've got another nine box inner in the store. Jaspiescasebreaks.com. Go and get it. All right. Well, TJ, if it makes you feel any <laughs> sorry, TJ, I'm sorry, buddy, but if it makes you feel any better, this batch of triple threads was was from a different shipment that came in later on. So the breaks that you were in, there were it's not like I picked the wrong case, you know what I mean? I don't know if that's going to make you feel any better, but it's not like it was sitting there within reach within your breaks, I guess. Uh, that's all that's the best I got. <laughs> sorry. Ty Cobb, Cody Bellinger, Correa, Adam Jones. Now, I would definitely feel worse if, if it was like, yeah, if it was in the first crop of cases, then yeah, then, you know, we were, it was within reach. 
All right, extra base hit. Seven out of eight. That's right, <laughs> Arthur. I did pull wood. A wood, a wood auto, not family show, ladies and gentlemen. We got Brian Dozier, extra base hit, seven out of eighteen twins. That'll be for Ryan Redman. He's got a nice auto. I think he's a free agent. Where does he end up? Maybe back on the Dodgers. Freddie Freeman reveals a Joey Votto, twenty-four out of twenty-seven. That's for T.J. Poyer and the Red Legs. Rich is saying that the, that the Angels triple, triple auto is incoming. There is a two out of three zeros in Boston, Masahiro Tanaka. Whoa, whoa, Arthur, that's a, it's a family show. Yankees going to Greg Esvang, who got the Yankees in a spot random. Got him for a fraction of the price. Two out of three, and a train whistle. All aboard the Big Hit Express, Greg. Whoop, whoop. Nice, and... Behind Cano is Justin Smoke. Smoking. 39 out of 99. Nicholas Secord with the Blue Jays. You're welcome, Greg. All right. Next one. Good luck, boys and girls. This is Pick Your Team 9. Almost done with Pick Your Team 9. Do I see orders coming in? I do. No, I don't. I do? I do. I see uh, see six orders coming in. So I don't know what I don't know what they're buying, but they're buying something, ladies and gentlemen. So we'll figure out what we'll do after this break. Got more triple threads. Jaspiescasebreaks.com. We got Piazza, two ninety nine. Barry Larkin to fifty. Evan Longoria, two ninety nine. Chip off the old block to one ninety nine. Base cards. And then we've got some Cubs, one out of nine. What's the Haps? Ian Hap. Switch homers, apparently. Goes to Jason and the Cubs. There you go. Hmm. David Ortiz revealing J.D. Martinez, one out of 18. I was going to say teammates, but they, they, they would not have overlapped. Brad Davis with the Red Sox. Behind Let's Play 2 is another Red Sox, David Price, October veteran, 17 out of 27. I feel like David Price should have been the World Series MVP. Maybe not. I mean, maybe not. And I guess Steve Pierce did, did do well too, but no love for David Price. That's another one for Brad Davis and the Red Sox. Behind Let's Play 2 is Jake Lamb, the first diamond back out of here. Six out of 50. Piece of the bat. And Jake Silence of the Lambs autograph. And that goes to Landon and the Snakes. Three boxes to go. Now, I don't think they gave the MVP to... I'm pretty sure they gave it to Steve Pierce for the Red Sox. World Series MVP. It was probably either going to be him, David Price, or Nathan Eovaldi. When is the last time the, uh, the losing team got, a, got the MVP? Or has that ever happened? All right, we got a printing plate right there. There's Addison Russell and King Felix. Oh, oh, you're Sam. Sam, you're saying that you personally thought it should have been Joe Kelly. I get it. I got you. All right, and it's Red Sox. Chris Sale. 
Chris Sale plate going to Brad Davis. And a train whistle for you as well. There you go. Oh, David Ortiz pulling some uh, some Top Series 1 cards. And a Tops commercial on MLB Network. Look at that. Uh, all aboard! Woo woo! I got distracted by Big Poppy uh, ripping some packs. There you go, Brad Davis. And there's Roberto Clemente to 259. All right, behind Granky is Jack Flaherty. Triple Relic and Autograph out of 75 for Eric Bailey and the Cardinals. And Zach Granke revealing a Ryan Zimmerman, 23 out of 36. Nationals, that'll be for EA and the Nats. Barry Larkin reveals a Mookie Betts, 28 out of 36. Another one for Brad Davis. Wow, Rex is reporting that it was just announced that Le'Veon Bell isn't going to go is not going to be reporting for the Steelers, which makes him ineligible to play. Jock Peterson, Jersey and Auto, 42 out of 50. A little Dodger Joe Mojo for Jeremy Carr. Wait, so what does that what does that mean for Le'Veon Bell? Can't he just get franchise tagged again? Or I guess Huh. I guess they were saying that I think his franchise tag would be so huge that the Steelers wouldn't want to offer him the tag. Do they, do they still have the rights to trade him? I don't know how that works. Brandon's saying he probably wants to make more garbage rap. Is he trying to make music? I don't think I realize that. Landon reporting that 11 and 12 triple threads just posted on the website, jazbeescaserakes.com. Go and get it. Go, go, go. All right. Big Sexy to 50. Rhino to 199. Darvish to 259 and Giancarlo to 99. Ozzy Smith, JD Martinez, Pedro, Roger Clemens. A lot of Red Sox base cards. Beyond Cal Ripken Jr. is Steven Strasburg. 18 out of 18. Swings and misses. He does generate a lot of swings and misses. It's for EA and the Nationals. Joey says Le'Veon's going to be a Jet next year or a Raider, maybe. Beyond Cal Ripken is Josh Harrison. Speaking of Pittsburgh, 7 out of 75, jersey and autograph. Josh Harrison, Ed Ram with the Pirates. When has the, when, oh, he has, he has music videos on YouTube? All right, Cano reveals Sean Newcomb, triple relic and autograph, 17 out of 75. JB saying it's terrible that he missed out on the next Immaculate. And those were sitting there since last night. You had plenty of time to pick up spots. Robinson Cano reveals an Addison Russell. Two out of 36. It's not like they were just posted five minutes ago and then they disappeared. Don't miss out on your spots, folks. Sometimes things can go uh, things can go fast. So if you see a break that you want to do, just buy into it right now. Might as well, ladies and gentlemen. Jaspiescasebreaks.com. All right, last box. So he's got music videos on YouTube, and there's one that... Oh, he does a shark song? Oh, that shark song. Jeremy S. saying the Steelers will fight the NFLPA for his rights. Oh, man, what, what a hassle. When is an athlete doing music ever... When has that ever worked? I think Damian Lillard actually has a decent record. Um... But, I mean, even then, you know, like, even then, you know, who knows? You know, maybe if he focused on that since he was a kid, but I don't know. I feel like 
athletes trying to be musicians or rap artists, whatever the case may be, generally doesn't turn out so good. Dion's I don't I don't remember Dion Sanders' record. Rizzo and Altuve. No, the LeBron Kevin Durant. Would well, you think that was? I think Kevin Durant was just trying to. His phrasing was trying to be. He was trying to be all uh, too much Tupac in there. I think. <laughs> Should we add the Dion Sanders music to the playlist? All right, behind Hank Aaron. More swings and misses. Six out of eighteen for EA and the Nats. The Bears album was the best, says Rich. We got Hank Aaron reveals a Matt Olson three color patch and autograph seven out of ten. Nice one for the A's, Philip with the Athletics. Shaq's music was, I mean, if you're saying it's so bad it's good, then yeah. But I'm talking like actual like quality music. Tim Raines, 15 out of 18. Speed at any age for Tim Raines. That's White Sox edition going to Barry Swisher. Was he was he other editions? No, he must have played for more than more than the White Sox. I, I remember him as a White Sox though. Let's play two. Reveals the last hit. A Rod. Seven out of 36. Alex Rodriguez jersey going to the Mariners. T.J. Poyer with that one. And there you have it, ladies and gentlemen. Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com. Pick your team 10 in the store. Pick your team 11. Pick your team 12 in the store. We got two random team breaks in the store. So check out all the triple threads action on jazbeescasebreaks.com. And we'll break more of this with you next time. Bye-bye.